how's it going? Welcome to a brand new video. I've got another NFL jersey for you. Um, yeah, so this was essentially this jersey I'm going to show you in a few moments. Was kind of the last NFL jersey I've I've, I've purchased. Um, I haven't bought any more for a couple of weeks now, but this was the last one I purchased. Um, it's an imitation jersey. It's an imitation jersey of the in Indianapolis Colts. Uh, it's Andrew Luck jersey, which is really cool. I thought he was an absolute beast when he was playing. Such a good player. Seems like a really top uh, top guy as well. So I'm really uh, pleased to get his jersey. Um, his, his name on the back of this jersey is really cool. Um, so basically it is a imitation jersey. So it's not not official, not real. But it's an imitation jersey of the Nike Elite jersey. So trying to imitate the um, Nike Elite jersey. If you're interested in imitation jerseys, the Elite ones, check out my um, review on this channel um, of some Nike Elite imitation jerseys. It's a really cool video. Um, so yeah, so they're going to be similar to this one I'm going to show you. So yeah, so let's get into it. So this is an imitation jersey of um, the Nike NFL Elite jersey. And as you can see from the off, kind of from the screen, it does look really good. Like I have been fortunate with these imitation jerseys. This is another one that looks really fresh and really on the money. Um, so you've got the, show you the NFL shield, looks pretty good. It's quite flat compared to the official ones. It is quite flat, flat, like it's quite, you know, a flat, um, flat shield when it's sewn on, but it still looks good, do you know what I mean? Like on face value, it does look really good. And then you've got the, the sizing tag in there, size 52, so like extra large in this type of jersey. Um, so there, yeah, that looks really good. This, this part of the shoulders, um, it's, it's kind of uh, quite like a stretchy material, but it's still really cool. It's quite comfortable, I must say. And then you've got the night tick and the, the number 12 on there. That look, looks pretty decent, do you know what I mean? It does look really good. Um, and then onto the back, you've got Lux surname. The main panel on here looks pretty good. And then the number 12 looks really good as well. So all round, a pretty decent jersey. Um, you've got the jock tag there which is really good and I actually forgot to mention this now it's kind of just suddenly dawned on me but um, with these elite imitation jerseys I've noticed that you do get um, kind of a um, you do kind of get this kind of mesh material under the shoulders for a little bit and then you can see I'll just show you so under the shoulders you get this mesh material and then it kind of um, at the very bottom of the jersey it kind of finishes but if, as you can can you see from there no sorry let me flip it around sorry so there you go you've got the um the shoulder under the underneath the shoulders and going down the chest um part you kind of got the mesh but then it kind of finishes on this part of the jersey but then the mesh kind of continues so the mesh kind of continues down to the bottom so you've got quite a lot of breathability uh breathability on this jersey which is quite cool um yeah, I didn't mention that on my on my um, imitation uh, Nike Elite jersey review, but I've just kind of noticed that recently. But that is really cool as well. And as well, you've got like a, a, a little kind of mesh material at the top where the name panel is as well. So that's quite cool, and it does make for a really comfortable jersey. Um, I don't own an official Nike um, Elite jersey, so I'm not sure um, if what the real ones are like. Um, but yeah, I've watched a few videos on them, but I can't remember to be honest. But that is a that is a cool feature, um, you know, on an unofficial jersey. It's got um, you know areas where it um, means for more comfort and breathability. So that's really cool. So yeah, so there you have it. Um, another another decent one, and I got this on eBay on an auction for a, a really good price as well. So I was I was really pleased with this. Um, yeah, so I'm going to pop the jersey on, show you guys what it looks like. Let's oh, hope it's yes. Do you know what? Do you know what, guys? I actually, I actually almost forgot how cool this looks on. Like the Indianapolis Colts home jersey is a fresh jersey. Like it does look really good. Like I love, I love blue as a colour. Blue and white. It's just, it's just a fresh jersey. It's just a clean jersey. It just looks really good. So yeah, so <laughs> I'm pretty pleased. But it's, it's only when you kind of, you know, obviously when you put it on. And, See what it looks. See, see in the camera what it looks like. Looking back at you, you realise how cool it is. So yeah, really chuffed with that. Um, 
So Indianapolis Colts jerseys, they they don't have any, they don't have like Colts written or any of their logos on the actual jersey. Obviously, they have their their Colts um, logo on the helmets, but on the jersey, it, they're they're pretty plain. Like there's no kind of like Colts works. You know, like on other NFL, well, on some other NFL teams, you'll have like um, you know the the logos of the teams, or sometimes you have the logos on the sleeves. But Indianapolis Colts are one of the t uh, one of the few teams that you know don't have the logos. But you know, I think it still looks really cool. Don't get me wrong, like I think it's good that some teams are different. Some teams do uh, different things. And obviously, if you've seen the jerseys that are coming out for the new NFL season, a lot of them are kind of really different. It seems like for so many years, like when Nike first produced the jerseys, a lot of the teams would keep quite safe. But it seems to me now that a lot of the NFL teams are kind of, um, yeah, having really kind of out there jerseys, which are really different, but really cool at the same time. So fair play to them, like, you know, big props to them for uh, for pushing things out there and, you know, making jerseys that are unique and different. But this, from a unique standpoint, I really do like this jersey. It's really good, like, the, the, the collar is really comfortable. It's quite a big collar on this one. But it is really comfortable, you know. I'm, I'm really pleased with it. And like I said, you've got, like, the stretchy material on just on that little little panel there which means extra comfort as well so so yeah this is a really really good jersey um let's pull that down a little bit it's a really good fit as well it's quite baggy so it's very long this one but i'm pleased i i, I like a long jersey as i'm always seem to be harping on about i might you know, i like a baggy jersey nowadays on my videos so I am pleased that it's baggy so it's cool do you know what i mean but the thing i like it's kind of quite tapered in the body it's long but a long kind of fit, really good fit, really pleased. So, so yeah, there you have it. And like you said, um, always kind of admired Andrew Luck. Um, I know he is retired now. He he retired at the kind of, um, yeah, kind of, it was the beginning of last. I know he did have a lot of injury trouble, and I I do feel, you know, I'm sorry for the guy because no doubt when he was fit and he was injury free, he was a really really awesome player. And I do feel bad for him because I think you know. Um, NFL is a game where you know these players we watch them on the TV as entertainment but the thing we've got to realize is these guys are putting their bodies their health their well-being on the line you know do you know what I mean kind of thing it, you know we, we watch them and admire you know their athleticism and skills and things like that but I know I'm stating the obvious facts but I think it needs to be said you know these guys week after week they're putting their bodies on the line and I, I don't normally say stuff like this on my channel. I don't usually offer too many kind of, you know, um, opinions on, you know, different sports people and things like that. But I just think it was really sad when um, the rumours about Andrew Luck retiring. Apparently he was at the um, Indianapolis Colts preseason game. So he kind of hadn't announced, it was just before the season, sorry, 2019 season. He hadn't announced he was retiring yet. But I think a lot of the fans have got wind that he would be retiring and they booed him when he walked past the walked, walked past um, one of the stands and do you know what I just think that's really sad you know for a guy that um, you know who, who was such an awesome player and unfortunately injuries happen in sport you know injuries happen you know these people you know no one is superhuman do you know what I mean we can't you know if you, you get an injury in sport you've just got to manage it and recover from it and I do feel really really sorry for the guy and I, I do think um, Basically, I do think the injuries took the t um, toll on him, and he's got every right, um, you know, he's got every right to say, you know, time away from the game. So, I think unfortunately that's it for his career um, for now. You know, I, th I think um, that is probably it. You know, but I, you know, a very promising player in the in the years that he did play, he was he was pretty awesome, Andrew Luck. So, so yeah, so pleased to get his jersey. Um, so yeah. Sorry for a bit of a rant, but I just feel that need to be said. I remember that did, that did leave a bad taste in my mouth um, when I remember seeing that on um, NFL Network, you know, in the preseason last year. Yeah, just something that didn't sit right with me. And like I said, I don't normally, you know, comment too much on these kind of things. I I just kind of show you products and stuff. But I feel like it needed to be said. But I feel happy now for getting half my chest. <laughs> it just it just um, basically it just kind of come to my attention when I got this jersey and thinking about Andrew Luck and stuff. So yeah, so really awesome player, Andrew Luck. Um, really chuffed to have his jersey. Really cool jersey as well. Love the colours. Love the kind of design of the Indianapolis Colts jersey. 
really cool jersey actually so yeah really pleased um, so there you have it guys I hope you enjoyed this video if you have any questions about this jersey or any other things comment down below I'll get back to you guys as soon as I can um, yeah and I'll see you guys in the next video until then take care see you guys later